out of 100, I'm gonna give this a... I'm gonna give this a 92. This barley wine pours a creamy two-finger tannish head with a reddish-brown murky body. Compared to the fresh version, the aroma is not as intense. The dark fruit aroma is non-existent and don't get that boozy smell. You get more of a multi-characteristic with caramel being the dominant aroma. So I made it to 50 reviews and since this is a spe such a special occasion, I decided to do 20, the 2011 version of Sierra Nevada Bigfoot Ale. As you can already tell from the beginning of the video, I've already reviewed it before when it first came out, which was in, it was bottled in June, July of 2011. Uh, right now it's August, August 23rd, so it's, it's a year and a month, or a couple months. So um, I got my notes here from the, pr the previous reviews, so I, I'm anxious to try this out. I've been literally waiting for this for a year now, so let's dig in and let's go guys. It's a lot sweeter, not really hoppy at all, um, there's, it's a mellow bitterness, the, the taste still lingers in your, on, on, in your mouth. You get like a sweet caramel flavor throughout the whole, the whole palate. Yeah, a lot, a lot of sweetness. This, this is actually pretty different from the, from the unaged version, unsellered version. Um, the unsellered version, I got a lot of dark fruits. Um, I did get sweet malts. This, this, from what I remember, this seems, this seems a lot sweeter. But the alcohol is not as apparent. I'm not. You still get it, but. Not as strong. You get a little in the, the alcohol, a little in the back end. But this, compared to the last last one, this one's the taste is a lot more distinguishable. Not it's not as complex, but I still like it. I'm gonna give this a a um, a eight for taste. Pretty much the same score I gave last time. There's just a different taste. I still like the first one better though. So I'm, I'm gonna give a score of 88, a B plus. Still a solid beer. I would say go out and get this, but you're probably not going to be able to find this unless one of your stores still has a 2011 version. But I wish I, I only got two bottles of this last year. Excuse me. Kind of wish I got the six pack. I don't know if there are any 2012. I'll see if there are any 2012s left at my store. Maybe we'll get a six pack and I'll do a review every year and see how it, how it ages. I really like this guy. So. I really want to try this out. I want to thank all my all my viewers for hanging with me for the last 50 reviews. I want to give a special shout out to um, Swingnet and Dean Barrera for checking out my commenting on the last few videos. So I really do appreciate it. And yeah, cheers, guys. Great one from Sierra Nevada. Have a day good. Have a good day. Have a good night. And cheers, guys.